What's up you guys? Welcome back to Simple Sick Builds. It feels so good to say that I've been gone for like six months, so I got some explaining to do. All right, you guys, the reason I haven't been uploading, there was an error with Google with my login password and they wouldn't let me log in and so forth. But now, after six months, I try to log back in and for some reason, they gave me temporary password to make my new password. So finally, I got it going on. So guys, I had a long story. I got more besides that. But if you're subscribed to the channel and you're a follower since day one, you guys know I got, I had a 2010 Lexus IS250 and I was commencing with the Miata Drift build. But now, I got rid of one of the cars and I got another car and you guys might be able to tell by the thumbnail so yeah guys uh, and I also got a trailer that I'm making into a car trailer so I can hold the car that I'm building yeah guys let's just jump into it my name is Carlos by the way if you guys don't know me if you guys like what you see and the other videos more to come so please consider subscribing to Simple Sick Builds. That being said, let me show you the cars. All right, you guys, you guys all remember my 92 of Mazda Miata. Still sitting on the same wheels that I got. I don't know if uh, you guys know, but same wheels that I bought. Uh, the bright one seat right here. I got a heavy duty uh, style bar. So this is not that plastic one. It's that metal one that shakes the whole damn car. I'll show you in a bit. And I also got a bash bar, rear bash bar, and that's about it. Still more to come for this uh, build. And uh, here is a trailer I was speaking of. This is the it's a boat trailer, and I'm gonna try to turn it into a car trailer. The only bad part is yo, yo boy don't know how to weld. So uh, yeah, guys, I actually bought a tongue for it, so I'm gonna drill in a tongue, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna fix it up little by little. I've been having it for like. A, probably like two months now or so so yeah guys that's gonna be the trailer to haul around the drift build Miata that I got going on here all right guys the car you guys all want to see well some of you don't some of you just hate me for it I actually sold my 2010 Lexus IS 250 to purchase a 2016 328i BMW this thing is beautiful I love it I love the driving aspect of it I do miss my 2010 like size 250 just I was I had that car for like 10 11 years now so I just thought it'd be something different for me and for you guys as well that follow the channel uh, the Lexus was a reliable car and I think the last video I uploaded of that car was replacing an O2 sensor, Bank 1 sensor, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, that's six months ago, but a lot of stuff happens in six months, so. <laughs> I'm going to give you a little bit of what I've done to this car since I've got it. Uh, I tinted the windows. It is 15% and 5% in the back, you know, every car guy does that. I also got a forged uh, carbon duckbill. I think it looks nice, but I think I'm gonna jump to carbon fiber. I don't know what you guys think about the forced carbon. I also got some 19s by nine in the back and 19s by eight in the front. They're uh, Ferta wheels. They're pretty, uh, they're pretty uh, good looking on the car, but I do wanna go like more of a deep dish style as well. And I also added a front lip to this car already. By the way, I have all the videos of this uh, little stuff that I've been adding on a different channel. I got frustrated that I couldn't log back into this channel. So I went off and opened another channel. And six months later, I tried to log back into Simple Sick Builds channel and I was able to. So this is why I'm so happy, guys. Well, let's continue. So I have the lip and I also got a... Uh, I guess it's called a Dynatune. Let me show you guys real quick. Let me open the door to this beautiful car. I also love the red stitching on the steering wheel. I just like this car all blacked out, just like I like my cars. I got this uh, Dynatune thing right here. And it's supposed to trick the car into thinking it's on low boost and it gives you that extra bump in boost. 
and uh, as I drive it this is my daily so I actually feel I felt the difference some people say they don't feel it but I actually felt the difference uh, it does waste a lot of more gas it turned into a damn gas guzzler after that all right you guys so let me explain what happened six months ago <laughs> I did a video doing an O1 an oxygen sensor bank one sensor whatever it was it was a sensor for the Lexus IS250 and uh, that was the last video I uploaded and I asked you guys should I sell my Lexus and I made a following up video but I never got to upload it for the reason is I lost all access uh, to simple sick builds YouTube account. I put my password in and I thought I got hacked So I reached out to Google and I told him hey, why is my stuff changed and they said unfortunately we cannot help you at this moment So I was like, okay, I'll hit you guys up two weeks from now because I wanted to upload the video and I never could so I got so frustrated and uh, I ended up just being like okay I lost it all my hard work and all the time I spent making all those videos for you guys You know, I don't get paid to do these videos. I do because I love it and I just the time and effort I put into it to show you guys what I know a little bit what I know I'm not a mechanic by no means so when people tell me are you a mechanic no I'm not a mechanic I just been messing with cars since I was like 14 younger than that probably that I can remember and uh, I just like showing you guys what I know probably can help someone out there even if you don't have the car you can like tell your buddy hey man I can do that for you that's that's all I do my videos for and I love cars like from the bottom of my heart so that's why I do them so uh, the whole point is I made a channel called Simply Sick, and right when I made that channel, I purchased my 2016 BMW 320i, and I started uh, uploading videos of me doing what I'm doing, adding the rims, adding the Dynatune, adding the front lip, adding the forged carbon, whatever, all that stuff. So I'm gonna see if I can get those videos and try to upload them to this channel. As for the Miata, same thing, whatever I have done to it from the last time, six months ago, I uploaded all those videos onto Simply Sick, but I will not be uploading to Simply Sick. I'm going to be uploading here to Simply Sick Builds, and I just want to thank all you guys that subscribe, that are that are just subscribing every day, and the subscribers that were there from the beginning. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I don't, I don't get paid for this. this is a, I work my nine to five every day come home work on my cars record for you guys and this is just fun I like doing it okay so don't think I'm like making money off this I'm not making money off this I just do it for fun I work my ass off I wake up at 4 40 in the morning go to work all the way to 3 30 in the morning 3 30 in the afternoon so yeah guys uh, the cars look beautiful over there I also got that trailer like I said and I still have my 2013 Chevy Silverado 2400 HD that I have not done nothing to it besides be my workhorse so yeah guys whoo I ran out of breath but thank you guys. Thank you for being here with your boys, supporting them. If you do, please give this video a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing down below. If you have any questions, unfortunately, I do not have the IS250 no more, so I cannot answer certain things. People are, I was looking through the comments and there's a whole ton of comments, people asking me, uh, can you show me this, can you show me that? Unfortunately, I can no longer show you anything about the IS250. I can give you pointers and stuff to do from the videos I have, but from there on forward, I don't know much about the IS250. I was just going along. It was my car, it was paid off. So I was just tearing into it. I didn't care. I was like, people can learn from my mistakes. That's the beauty of YouTube. So uh, yeah, guys, I'm gonna leave you with cinematics of the cars. So please guys, if you love this, the comeback for Simple Sick Bills, please give it a thumbs up. With that being said, guys, peace out and enjoy the cinematics.